Hey guys, welcome to the video today. In today's video, I am going to give a tutorial on how to use the Greater Goods Food Scale. Okay, so the first thing that we need to do if we take a look at the back of the Greater Goods Food Scale, there is a battery compartment cover right here. And if you haven't already, there should be a plastic tab and you need to remove that so the battery can make contact with the Greater Goods Food Scale. And if you want to learn how to replace the battery, I do have a video where I show how to do that step by step and I'll link that video at the end of this video. Okay, so if you have a weight showing on the scale but there's nothing on the scale, I'm going to show you how to reset it. Okay, so to reset the food scale, we just want to hold down the power button until the scale turns off. And now we can turn the scale back on by pressing the power button and we should get a zero weight. And to weigh something, we'll just place this avocado on the scale and then it will tell you the weight uh, currently in pounds and ounces. And to switch the unit of measure, we're just going to press the unit button and now it's measuring in grams and now it's measuring in fluid ounces and now it's measuring in milliliters and now it's back to measuring in pounds and ounces. And if you want to weigh something in a bowl, we're going to place the bowl onto the scale. And then we need to press the zero button so it accounts for the weight of the bowl. And once we zero the scale with the bowl on it, the bowl icon will show up on the display. And now I'm going to place the avocado inside of the bowl. And the display will turn off after two minutes of no activity. And you can change that to not turning off until there's five minutes of no activity by pressing and holding the hold button until the clock symbol shows up. And then whenever you're done, we can remove the bowl and whatever was being weighed. And then turn the scale off by pressing and holding the power button. All right, guys, that was it for this video. I hope it's been helpful and thank you so much for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment, and I hope to see you guys in the next video. Have a good one. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment. And if you have the time, check out these other great videos.